The only guaranteed way to go home with fish is to stop by the grocery store, but we still go anyway. I guess there's always a chance you're going to catch them. So we recently took a tour of the Pocomoke and Tangier Sounds to find out if any fish would let us take them home. We head out of Crisfield with friends Russell Harrison and Tim Brittingham. Yep. We're not going to be very picky. It's been a rough summer. Anything that bites the hook. So we're desperate. Oh. We're desperate today. Yeah, we need, we need to put some meat in the freezer. <laughs> Our first stop starts off rather promising. I'd already got a small rock in the first couple of casts before Russell's first cast delivers. Yep. <laughs> right there on it. The first couple casts and we've got two fish, one being a keeper. Things are looking good. Hopefully they'll keep getting bigger. Despite the good start, only one of the rockfish caught would be coming home with us. Most just fractions of an inch too short. The fish stop biting here, so we continue the tour, making our way around Pocomoke Sound. We make some stops around former hot spots of fish, but it appears as though they have moved on. Our fishing trip basically turns into a boat ride. But of course, it becomes a scenic boat ride. We caught fish. Only got one keeper, but well, one is better than none. Fish in the cooler, man. That's fish right. in the cooler. At least one of us is not going home alone. It wasn't a great day of fishing, but it sure beats sitting around wishing we were fishing. <laughs> 